Hello everybody! Today I'm going to be showing you a very simple, wearable, daytime eyebrow that is going to leave people just wanting more. This is going to be really simple, a very easy technique that you can use in your daily life. So let's just jump right into it. You're going to start with foundation. Anywhere, you know, that your eyebrow grows, you're going to want to do that. And this is just so that we have a very solid base. So we're just going to blend this into our forehead area right above our eyes because you know you want to do all this before you do your eye makeup so you can just pat this in after you've blended it now you're going to want some kind of white highlighter you can either use a cream foundation i have um some theater makeup um, by ben nye and that's just perfect so you're going to take some white and you're going to put it right underneath your eyes because or right underneath your brow because that's going to accentuate your eyebrow and it's going to really just exaggerate that placement of it. Now this look is really just eye catching I think. I've, I frequently like to use this you know when I go out to the mall or to buy Starbucks or you know if I'm sucking dick. This is a really great tool in your daily life to really just reach and, and attain any possibilities. We're going to do some simple powder. Now I just have a palette of porcelain. This is ES40. This is by Morphe brush. And then this brush here is e.l.f. Professional Eyeshadow Brush. Can you see it? And so we're just going to take this powder and we are going to again just highlight right underneath our eyes because this really just exaggerates what we're going to create and this just gives a, a really good solid foundation for your eyebrows. It really just helps you like pinpoint the direction you want to take your brows in. Now, using your own natural brows, you know, you can do that, but it is recommended by most beauty gurus that you completely remove your eyebrows, either with shaving or tweezing, and then you create your own brows afterwards and you use this exact step. I was watching some beauty gurus tutorials and this is exactly what I learned. So I I'm translating it from beauty guru to the home, the, the everyday modern woman. Next I've got this fantastic eyebrow pencil that I got from um, something that starts with BEA. And on one side it says Mahogany 714553. So you're just going to then trace over your eyebrow if you are creating from your natural brow and um, the chunkier the better. Chunky eyebrows are definitely in right now and the whole reason for that is you know because it, it it's statement you know. So you want to kind of like where you, your nose ends where those where those lines are like think these two parallel lines on your nose that's where you want your eyebrow to end so like here my the the parallel line of my of my nose ends here so this is where I want my eyebrow to start so then you want to just bring it straight up and don't worry if this makes you look menacing or or Frankenstein monster ish at all and what you want to do is you want to just create this really dramatic arch that connects all the way down towards the end of where you've created all of this white here and it want, you want it to end in in this really sharp point. Now the more like McDonald's arches you've got the better. Some people who I would identify with racially who like to call themselves cholas like to call this the the arch of a victory. So now we're just going to take a white eyeliner pencil and we're just going to exaggerate this line just a little bit right underneath just a little bit beautiful we're on a great start this isn't even the end guys there's a couple more steps it's very very simple though so now I'm going to take my eyebrow kit that I've got there's six different colors and then a setting wax where's my fucking brush there it is so we're just going to take an angled brush doesn't matter what kind this is by elf and you're going to want to start with kind of a lighter color. So I'm going to kind of go with this like, mm, I'm going to call this caramel. It doesn't have any coloring on it. And you're just going to trace right over your line. And again, chunky eyebrows are really in this season. It's good, especially since we're getting into the winter time. You, um, you really want to have these eyebrows that are going to keep you warm. You know, because you never know when your man is going to run off on you. 
and you're just not going to have any warmth in your life, in your heart, in your soul, or in your vagina. So you want to just have as much warmth on your face as possible, because who knows when the next guy's going to sit on it. So whatever shapes you want, your eyebrows are supposed to be um, cousins, they're not supposed to be sisters. There are some people who, who say that you are supposed to have these twin sister eyebrows, and that is just, that is not the case, you know? Um, if you bring all this up into your forehead, it will really just, it'll just, it's magic, you know? So then we're going to take our next dark color, the one that's right next to this. It doesn't matter what kind you use, as long as you are just progressing in color. You want to start with light and then build your way out to the dark. And you want to just, you know, build upon those colors so that you have depth colors what it's called now some people really like these ombre eyes where it starts really light at the beginning we can totally do that and for the purpose of this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to do that so we're just gonna take this caramel color and put it right on the inner corner that's what this is called of your eyebrow the lightest one you've got even if you want to use white you could totally do that if you've got some kind of kit that has white eyebrow you know material in it totally use that and then we're gonna just start building the color darker as it goes out it gives you just this really nice ombre and then we're gonna take our darkest one and you really want to just exaggerate the underside of your eyebrow now what this gives is it makes it look like you've got these really healthy eyebrows you know that's what the whole purpose of this dark line is you don't want it to look like you've got drawn on the eyebrows you want it to look like these are your natural eyebrows and anyone that sees you from a hundred feet away is going to say, man, but that person over there, they've got some really strong eyebrows. And that's what people are going to say about you when they see you. They're going to be like, damn, her eyebrows are on fleek. That is some strong eyebrow game right there. I don't think anyone says strong eyebrow game anymore, but someone will certainly, certainly say it about you. People, when they see you with this eyebrow, will certainly say a lot of things about you. Magnetic, right? Kind of unforgettable, I think. Inspired. You're painting for the back room. You're painting for the back wall over there. Anyone over there, they're gonna, they're gonna see you and they're gonna be like, damn. Work, bitch. 